So literally, Venerable Vasu here has 10 minutes before he has to board. Just wanted to give a special thanks to Venerable Vasu and the opportunity that he's giving me. Um, I didn't even know he was coming. I was gonna watch this monastery all by myself and the ghosts, I'm afraid of ghosts. He came and spent time with me, gave me the opportunity to shadow with him with Arizona Faith Network, a bunch of meetings. Able to, I'm able to test the teachings of the Buddha, prescribe the teachings of the Buddha for world peace in front of hundreds of people, dozens and hundreds of people affected, directly affected and inspired by the teachings upon uh, by feedbacks that we have gathered. He's leaving and I'm gonna miss him dearly. Both of us have a lot of agendas. His, his calendar is crazy, absolutely crazy. And I have a lot of competing priorities back in Florida with my parents and interpreting and all that good stuff. So all of us wish him uh, safe travels in the forthcoming days. And thank you for coming down here to spend time with us. Anyone that wants to change the world, get with Vasu. He will show you how to change the world. He will open the opportunity for you to meet people, bishops, pastors, reverends, priests, you name it. Um, and that's how things get done in the world, by and through dialogue, by and through collaboration and networking. So I just wanted to wish him and thank you for being such a good friend. Um, as Theravadin and Zen, we, we do get into it with, uh, with discussions. So it's pretty fun. Um, and uh, we, we hold each other dearly as good friends on the path to peace. And we hope to share all of that with you in the forthcoming days with all of the videos that we've taken. May you all be well, be happy, be free, and always be healthy. May Vasu always be well. May he always be healthy. May he always be happy and continue serving all of us in the forthcoming days. May you be well, happy, and healthy. Take care, folks. <laughs>